I think this is the best one so far. Like if you want something dense in your face, hard to swallow. Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. And again, back in my studio slash bedroom because still in lockdown, still at home. I hope you guys are staying safe and not going out unnecessarily. Also, get registered for your vaccines. We need to get this Rona shit over real quick. So if you follow me on Instagram, I recently shared a post where it was like a throwback throwback thursday where i shared one of the best donuts i've ever had in london those were filled donuts from bread ahead bakery which i had in borough market if you want to see that video the link is going to be in the description box below they have some extremely delicious donuts right here you can see the filling oozing out can you see the filling Look at that. So the other one we got is sea salt caramel and honeycomb donut. You can see the honeycombs right here. Mmm. Mmm. This is so good. And I started craving for filtered donuts. And you know, that got me wondering, where can I get really good flavored filled donuts in Dhaka? which led to the birth of this video. The best donut in Dhaka series. We're gonna hunt for the best donuts in Dhaka. So it's gonna be a series where I try donuts from different places in each video. And then we're gonna have a final conclusive video where we rank the best donuts in Dhaka. So whenever I think of really good donut, glazed comes to my mind, but I wanted to give this place a shot before I try Glaze. I never had donuts from them. They reached recently reached 10k followers on Facebook. So congratulations to Mystic Morsel. So their filled donuts look really good and they reminded me of the ones that I had in London which led me to ordering from them. So we ordered four filled donuts and two glazed donuts. Let's get unboxing. Let's see what's in my box. So we have tiramisu filled donut. We have Vanilla custard filled donut. We have a blueberry blueberry cream cheese filled donut and we have Cinnamon sugar and Nutella filled donut here. We have two glazed donuts This is a strawberry glaze and a chocolate glazed donut. I don't know about you But I am salivating and it smells like freshly fried sweet donuts I don't know how to start this because I am excited to try each of the flavors but I think I'm gonna start with the filled donut since I've been craving for a filled donut and the most basic filled one is the custard one so this is their vanilla custard filled donut you can see they have sprinkled sugar very soft very heavy which means it's filled nicely so i'm gonna try the custard filled one because i feel like it's the classic mm. i mean can you see the custard oozing out the custard is very light and fluffy and definitely custardy the donuts very airy. airy as you can see it's very airy spongy also it's not too sweet so if someone doesn't like overly sweet donut you can give this a shot i really like the custard almost as good as bread ahead vanilla custard donut or the custard tarik too i guess or the dota is like too more hearty i guess mm. Ingredients, I guess, although ingredients are different. Next, I'm gonna try a glazed one. So, I'm gonna try the strawberry glazed donut. I really like how spongy and airy their donuts are. Like, it's not very flat or crispy like those American donuts. Yeah. Or like a crisp, crispy kind. So, the strawberry glazed donut. It's pretty nice. It has a nice strawberry glaze flavor and a very fluffy, airy donut. Not my favorite because I don't necessarily like strawberry flavored stuff all the time. But it's not bad. So next try the cinnamon sugar and Nutella. I really don't like cinnamon, so I'm not sure where the cinnamon is. If it's outside or inside, we're gonna find out. But I do like Nutella or Nutella at times, so let me break this apart. Okay, that's a lot of Nutella. Nutella filled donut. Mm. 
This is for the heavy Nutella lovers. Because it feels like I'm eating Nutella and bread, <laughs> to be honest. Intense Nutella and chocolate lovers. Like if you want something dense, in your face, hard to swallow. Not my favorite. Not mine either. I don't like something that's too Nutella -y. Like it's overwhelming. Yeah. To me. Next, we're gonna try the chocolate glaze. It's shiny. It's pretty. It's very, very shiny. So, the chocolate glazed donut from Mystic Morsel. The glaze is a little weird. It tastes like Hershey's chocolate syrup rather than... Mm, it tastes like Hershey's chocolate syrup. Not in a good way. Probably one of the... Least liked. Yeah. I was gonna say worst, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Next, you're gonna have the tiramisu filled donut. I've recently started liking tiramisu. Like, I had this tiramisu from Hobnob, which was pretty nice. And yeah. I don't know why I never used to like it. So I'm gonna take a bite from the tiramisu donut. Oh my god. Ooh. Mmm. Oh wow. It has a cream and coffee filling. It's not too strong, but it definitely tastes like tiramisu. Ooh, I really like it. I think this is the best one so far. Oh wow. Alright. It's definitely it's not like a regular donut. It's a little different. The flavors are bang on. I really like it. But the dota is better with the butter. I think it's a flower. It's a flower issue. So just we just have one more donut left, but before that, let's say which one was our favorite. In three, two, one. Tiramisu. And let's say which one was our least favorite. In three, two, one. Chocolate, Chocolate glazed. glazed. Second best Kuntal Laksa Kamakashi. Which one did you think was the second best? Amakasa, I think Nutella. I, I think liked the vanilla custard after tiramisu because the Nutella was just too much. But if you like chocolate and if you like Nutella, yeah. you're gonna like that. So then last, I've saved the best, hopefully, for the last. It is blueberry cream cheese. Can you see the color? Can you see the color? It matches my t-shirt. And if you're wondering where to get the t-shirt from, it's in my merch line and you can check the link in the description box below. So this is the last one, blueberry cheesecake. Ooh, mmm. Oh wow, you can see blueberry chunks inside. Oh, that is very well balanced. It has a little less cream cheese, but I really like the flavor of the blueberry. It has a it has a good tang to it. I think it complements the donut quite well. Mm. Ooh. Blueberry cheesecake donut. So that was me trying some of the filled donuts and two glazed donuts from Mystic Marcel. Definitely solid donuts. Really liked some of the flavors. Some flavors were just hit and miss. But again, different people, different perspective. You might like what I don't like or you might not like what I like. Just basic human nature. And yeah, I liked them, but I am still not sure if they're the best donuts in Dhaka because I do have a few more places to try, namely Glazed. So in my part two of this series, I'm gonna try donuts from Glazed. And then maybe in the next video, we're gonna try donuts from some other place. Kings, we have to try donuts from Kings because as far as I remember, the donuts from Kings are pretty good. So yeah. And if you have any more suggestions on where to get really good donuts in Dhaka, do leave them in the comment section below or where your favorite donut place is. What do you think of the donut scene in Bangladesh? Do let me know. I am curious. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. March alert. So guys, What's In My Box has finally launched her merch and we're coming out with two designs. This is the first one, I'm calling it a little dramatic popsicle. Because you know, I'm a little dramatic, I love colors and this is a color block style t-shirt and it just reminded me of popsicle. It has a pink body with pastel blue and pastel yellow sleeves and as you can see, you can move around freely in that. The next design shows my love for boba as you guys know and it says boba 
life. And again, it's oversized drop shoulder t-shirts and we have it in two. We have it in two different colors. It's the taro and butter. And you know, if you love boba or you love the designs, do go for them. Everything's in limited quantity because I believe you're almost one of a kind. So get them before they get sold out because I want you to have the March you want. Hurry up because I don't want you guys to miss out and you can check the link in the description box below. You can buy it from both Instagram and Facebook. Once again, very exclusive, limited quantity. Hurry up while we have it.